I'm still working on that five grand. I need that. A little game. Five for 50. Whoa! First question. Where was St. Patrick from? Um, I know he fled because <laughs> of snakes. <laughs> Ireland? That's where he went. Where was St. Patrick from? Ireland. No, See, I don't think no. that's, that's the obvious answer. It's either England or France or Italy. No. I'm thinking Italy. Italy? I, I have a clue with Pizzi Saint. Okay, okay, Italy. Italy. Bing, bing, bing. St. Patrick <laughs> is from... Switzerland, Britain, England. Uh, yeah, that seemed like the obvious answer. All right, we're already out. Please First go. Go. I'll tell you what. We'll pretend that didn't happen. Okay. Okay. Next question: Who was the second Catholic president? What's up with these Catholic questions? It's for St. Patty's oh, Day. No. JFK. No. No. Wait, the second one. Absolutely Catholic not. president. I'm going uh, Eisenhower. I was going Theodore. Theodore Eisenhower. I, I would say Abe Lincoln. Lincoln. No, 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 no. No, he Why? was not. He was not a Catholic. <laughs> The second Catholic president. Samuel Adams. I think he was the second president ever. No, that was John Adams. <laughs> Samuel Adams is beer. the president too, though. Right? No, I didn't. <laughs> Somebody said JFK. <gasps> uh, oh, well, here's a hint. Yeah. He was the first. <laughs> JFK was a wow. first. Catholic president? Uh -huh. He was the first. I mean, yeah, it was JFK like a really. Was the first yeah, it was like a really president? big deal. Bush. You know. I Bush is a good Bush. answer. Yeah, I say Bush too. Wrong again. Ronald Reagan. That is incorrect. It's uh, Joe Biden. Really? He's the second Cali president. You please the stop. stupidest f***ing people in yeah, the Next you? question. What's a paddy wagon? In the back of the paddy wagon. There, there you go. <laughs> No, a it's car. a drunk bus. It's a drunk car. In the back of the a drunk paddy car? wagon. They were getting... Uh, so yeah. I love you know that. I love... Does everybody else get that <laughs> reference? They're getting you know what in the paddy wagon. Cadillac. Paddy, paddy. What song am I singing? That'll be a bonus question. Hold on. We'll, we'll get back to it. Paddy wagon. What is a paddy wagon? A free ride home from the pub. Maybe not home. But jail. So a paddy wagon is a, a paddy wagon is a, a, a fun bus to jail. I've been in paddy wagons just one time. I've been in paddy wagon once, but I don't have any cool like I was chained to a bench with three other dudes. Were you right. with the dudes to begin with, or no, 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 they were already in there. They picked me up on the run, you know, taking them. They stopped off and got me. Good story to go along with that pickup. Probably something I shouldn't talk about on here. In the 1840s and 50s. Over half the people arrested in New York City were Irish. Mm. So they started calling oh, them wagons man. that they paddy rounded up all wagon. the Because they were full of patties. So According to Wikipedia, Philly has the third highest oh Irish <laughs> population. Who has the first? Oh my gosh, there's a lot. United States City? Boston. Boston. Yeah. I was no. thinking Boston. No. Mm. Boston. I'm kind of I'm thinking New York. Milwaukee. Minnie, what the hell? St. Patrick's Cathedral. Miami, Minnie. I think it's Boston because I agree Boston with Boston. Sharp. The Celtics? Yeah, Boston. Celtics. <gasps> I know an Irish guy from Boston. <laughs> <laughs> it has Boston. to be locked in. Ding, ding, ding. Massachusetts. Oh, you got it! Let's go! You got one! I always said, dude, Boston people are like Philly's uglier cousins. Or maybe we're the ugly cousins. All right, final question. Final question. What you know about Irish car bombs? I know that last week, my dad got one given to him at a bar, and he took the shot and then drank the beer. Like, yo, dude! <laughs> I'm not in Ireland, so I don't want to just repeat what I read on the internet, but I do know they're not super popular in Ireland, and it's either because there was a lot of car bombs in Ireland in, like, okay. the 70s and 80s and 90s, I believe. So they, they took offense to that name. It was one thing I heard. The other thing I heard was Irish people just got offended that you would mix beer with anything else yeah, but yeah. we're ignorant americans so my right. question for you is yes. what are the three ingredients of an irish car bomb uh jaeger a guinness and uh there's nothing else in it what else is in it whiskey jameson no it's jameson guinness and jaeger fifth question but then i'll give you a bonus <laughs> okay. fifth question what's in an irish car bomb oh no oh. let me talk a guinness on the bottom and then it's Bailey's Irish cream, and then you drop it in. In what? In the Guinness. There's three ingredients. Yeah, the Guinness stout. Irish whiskey. What's the cream? whiskey? Yeah. Who said it? Oh man, I got excited. You got it right. I kind of gave it away. But yeah, Woo! whiskey, whiskey cream and stout. Super. Well done. What's just the Jaeger in the beer? Jaeger bomb. Um, That's a Jaeger bomb. I'm a yeah. <laughs> Delete all this, dude. I'm not a big drinker. Yeah, For a bonus question, you referenced trying. Back of the Packing Wagon, a song, a very popular song uh -huh. in Philadelphia. And that's a hint. 
If you can get that before Soulja we get Boy. to your destination, I'll give you twenty bucks. Wait, twenty dollar song. Twenty dollar bonus I question. I know it. What is it? Wait, There's one that more question, it. right? No, that was it. That was five. Ah, dude, we what a disgrace! Five. Look at this. Five. I got shamrocks tatted here and here. I was always proud to be an Irishman. I definitely have Irish anger. What I tell people is that when they're say Dan O'Malley, I say, Yeah, we dropped the O, dude. I make it more American. Do you know what O and Mick stand for? O and Mick? Yeah. Uh, O stands for, oh, shit. Mick, uh, Mick Double? The, like, like, O'Doyle, like yeah. O'Doyle rules yeah. O'Malley. O, o is like a prefix for grandson of, and oh. Mick is son of. I always wondered why we weren't O'Malley. Yeah, but, yeah, when Irish people came <coughs> over to, uh, the States, a lot of them dropped it because yeah, you know, there was a bit of a stigma. There was a bit of a stigma being yeah. Irish. Yeah, if it was 2022, we'd be saying, Irish lives matter! <laughs> Twenty dollar bonus question. Yeah, I think she's right. I think I'm what right. lyric is in the back of the paddy it's wagon? Dreams and nightmares, isn't it? By Nail. Nailed it! Yeah! Let's go! I used to pray for times like, like this to run like this <laughs> and I'm back in the time I spent in the locked up shit. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. In the back of the <laughs> paddy wagon, <laughs> cuffs locked on wrist. Okay, I never do a paddy wagon knife, but that's true. I like that now. 